So, um, I decided to, uh, just go ahead and go to Tatooine because I've been <clears throat> standing in this queue for kind of mini, whatever. Um, and yeah, I, I, my break is over. It's time to play for another six hours, baby. And, um, oh boy. Oh, my back is hurting. Holy crap. Um, I don't think I've ever been... The farthest I ever got on the Republic side was 24. So, I did a little bit of Tatooine. But after this, I haven't seen any of, like, the sides or quests or, um, anything. Like, I haven't seen any of the camps or quests for the Republic after this. So, it's going to be pretty new. Some of it. I mean, we, we go to the same planets that you do on the other, on the Empire. But, I mean, you go to, like, different camps, different buildings, um... Different quests, so, you know, and the dungeons are different too, a little bit. Just a, they're, they're like the same, but the, like the backstory is different, basically. So, yeah, so yeah, boy. Ah. And uh, I'm yawning like crazy right now, cause my nose is getting stuffed, and uh, I'm not breathing, and so it's just like. Breathe. And uh, since we're 27, we don't need to do any side quests, so we're just going to be doing the main quest. And, uh, and Katamin Kata Kataminu, or Katamimu, however you pronounce it. I think I just said it right there. And I think I'm done with the war zones, because we keep getting the same damn one, and I'm getting so sick and tired of it. At least we're done for a while. I'm going to wait. I'll wait until we, like, finish chapter one or something to do others. Did I buy the new skills? Yeah, I did. Okay. And I'm excited because we got Tidal Force now, and it's going to be freaking amazing. That's all I'm saying. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be freaking amazing! And I think I have the wrong companion out. Yeah, we were we had Theron out last time. Come on, Theron! You need my expertise. Let's go, Theron! Let us be off. The Enclave lightsaber, man. We got that. That was a big upgrade, and our helmet was a big upgrade, too. Okay, so the space station looks exactly the same. I know that for a fact that outside looks different. Yeah. Anchor head. So, yeah, um... All those quests, you'll have to be d you do stuff in the town, but again, we're only doing the main quest here, so we're not doing any of that. And I just got a message on uh, Skype. Okay, they were just telling me bye. My bad. Am I stuck in midair? I'm looking at my preview over there. I think I skipped while I was in midair. Whoops. Okay, shouldn't be any more Skype. Messages. If there is, I'll just ignore it. Ignore it. Oh yeah, yeah. Freaking ignore it. Hee <laughs> hee. I already got that one. More adventure. Welcome. Okay. Now Tatooine is our first like open world PvP planet. Um, I don't think anybody's really gonna mess with us. They usually don't. If they do, I guess they do. If anybody messes with us, it's gonna be a level 55 guaranteed. Damn 55s. Ganging up on the lower levels. Hurts, bros. Apparently there's nobody queuing for, uh... Katamimu, either. Then again, it is 1 o'clock at night, so I'm sure everybody's in bed. So now it's that, it's that time of night where it's gonna be really hard to find... Um... It's gonna be really hard to find, uh... Stuff. Like, people for... Dungeons. I haven't been here. Did I mention I'm a pacifist? Did you mention you're a pacifist? Yes, multiple times, many, many of times. What is this one for? <laughs> Mandalorian Raiders. I already did that one, brah. I already did that one, brah. So where do we gotta go? Somewhere in here. There's a ah. Okay, so what we're looking for a, a Jedi that's like it gets 
aliens under our side. Tyrants, damn tyrants, the lot of you. Treating a grown man like he's a baby. Like he can't take care of himself. For a man who's supposed to be ill, he certainly is vociferous, which is to say, loud. Lie down, Delk, and quit roaring. I swear, a Ranko with heartburn would make less noise than you. I'll make as much noise as I want. Hey, Jedi! You a friend of Master Eris? Get Darth Nurse here off my back, will you? Master Eris is exactly the reason I've come to talk to you. You two can talk, but don't let him fool you into letting him walk, Jedi. He's got the sand rot, and bad. <coughs> Man breathes in a little sand, and after 20 years guiding folks through the desert, he suddenly <coughs> can't make decisions for himself. What's it you wanted to know about Master Eris? It's a bit of a long story. I'm listening. Jedi Plague? Begging your pardon, but uh, I don't believe it. Sure, maybe some masters, but not Master Eris. He's the brightest, most level-headed guy I ever met. These Jedi Masters are among the Order's best. That's what makes this plague so serious. Look, you want to talk to him? <laughs> You're welcome to it, but I'm telling you, he's just as sane as you or me. When I left him, he was in the desert with them annoying little Jawas. I <laughs> really impressed him how they managed to survive out there. I'll go talk to these Jawas, then. They're friendly folk, the Jawas. Even if they don't understand the meaning of the words private property, if Master Ares isn't still with them, I'm sure they'll help you find them. Okay. Well, see you later! <laughs> so we're gonna go talk to some Jawas. Well, there's a Jawa right there. Oh, uh, we've seen enough of Jawas. We had Blizz, baby. Good old Blizz, my best friend. I couldn't be mean to him, man. As much as I wanted to be mean to him, because it fit my character, I couldn't do it. Could never do it. He was my little buddy. He was my little friend. So how- this thing's pretty damn far away. Then again, that is Tatooine. It's a cool concept, but damn, you have to travel a lot through Tatooine. Like, it's cool, but damn. This poor Tauntaun, though. This Tauntaun's not used to this friggin' weather. I don't think... Taunt Tauntauns are only on cold planets. That's the problem here. <laughs> poor little Tauntaun. You poor little baby. Kiss him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Whoops. <laughs> um. Do not notice me. It's almost like I'm heading all the way back to freaking what's his face? Lots of traveling on the road. Seems like uh, the Sith have a better side starting star side on Tatooine. This one's just like traveling where they have like rocks and crap. They have like cliffs and hills and stuff. Whereas ours are just like this. Oh, sweet! We're gonna be go Oh, man, it's one of those giant, like, uh, metal... I don't know what you call them. Droid key? Whoa, and it's on fire. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Well, we know what happened here. How did one Jedi do all of that? What? Am I facing, like, the best Jedi in the world or something? Oh, my God. That fire looks really crappy. What the hell? Ow! Yes. War droids. That's quite enough of that. So. What? I'm confused how tidal wave works. Okay, it works. Costs no force and activates instantly. What does that mean? Activates instantly. What can you tell me of this other Jedi? Why did Master Eris instruct you to build war machines? 
Fou hao ato polio is di moto, se goto wupi wupi. Disclui dopa, bolta gepta yon kos paska polia. Give me this message. Rana nu plata dunki tuli? La zoba non botafa, ada ki kura ci tu di konolia. Kula wa wunde ya pawa kuka to rundi. If I help you get your parts back, will you help me find the war maker? Hopo ma wanka to duska, udwana wada zuka kupa. Yuna liska chanaga wa chi, kaspeina kontrika. Odruda ma rulia, tu batagi wa tima. So these guys over here are waiting now, it says over here. Okay, we're looking for Geonosians or something. They from that one planet in Star Wars Clone Wars or something? Oh well. So basically he made them make robots, but then didn't... I don't even... what? A little confused. Tad bit confused. Oh yeah, Geonosians. Why are the heck are they on Tatooine? That's you weird. My expertise. Did I mention I'm a okay, I'm confused how Tidal Force works. Really you have heard okay, I'm I'm confused. I'm confused how Tidal Force works. Hang on. Disturbance turbulence force quake grant tidal force when activated. Tidal Force immediately finish the cooldown on telekinetic wave and makes your next telekinetic, telekinetic wave activate instantly and cost no force. So do, does it have to be on cooldown? I, I don't understand. I'm confused. Like watch, hang on. It's not working. I don't. I don't understand it. Oh, telekinetic wave. Oh, not throw. God, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I am. I am an idiot. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Telekinetic wave, not throw. Oh my God, I'm dumb. <laughs> wow. I'm an idiot. I am a retard. Holy crap. Yeah, it's the wave. So that's actually really good. Holy crap. That's actually better than just having throw instantly. Wow. That is actually really good. That's it. Wow. You guys are probably going to scream at me for like a couple videos thinking that it's throw. If you've had a Jedi Counselor, that is. Okay, I just need this last one. Man, I am doing so much damage now. God, I love the console. I think I like it more than the Bounty Hunter, I'm not gonna lie, people. I think... What the hell? What the hell? I, I think I just got hit by a damage over time and then it unmounted me. This is amazing. The con I love the console so much more. I think... If you're out there right now and you're listening this far in... You should make... A casting inquisitor or consular. It's it's amazing. I think an inquisitor would be better. If you like lightning, boom. If you want to throw, like if you want to use like light moves, I guess I don't even know what to call them. Light moves and rocks, and I guess do um the consular. <laughs> I believe this is what you wanted. Oh, 
ングドバンゴルーホープマワンカトゥドスカウドワンワンダスカクーパー I am quite honored. Not till I sooner say Allah. Did you get me? What the heck is that? A Jawa cloak? Merely a scratch. The hell? <laughs> that thing sucks. <laughs> After all that, he gave me that. Oh my. I'm gonna go ahead and waste my fast travel. Screw it. adventure. Man, I really like the casting. I really like it. Oh, man. <sighs> if only I would have known about, like, I've, I wanted to make it, like, whenever I was level 30. I don't know. I, I, I definitely started the Bounty Hunter, but... So, I wish I would have known, like, wanted to start it... Shall we? ...for my Empire side, but... Because lightning would have been so much cooler, but you know what? Whatevs. Oh, there, Jedi. Would you look at this? They let me walk around the clinic. <laughs> Soon they might let me cross the street by myself. <laughs> Any luck finding Master Ares? I didn't find him, but the Jawas said he made this for you. What's this? <laughs> A m message from Master Ares? Well, I know this encryption. Shouldn't take long to crack. Oh, there. Care to see what he has to say? Rowan, you've realized by now that I've left those most resourceful of creatures, the Jawas, in pursuit of greater things. I came to Tatooine to discover the secret to life. Not its creation, but its ongoing survival. How do some species thrive while others fail? A great darkness is coming, Rowan, and to withstand it, we must know the answer to that question. He chose a strange place to start. <laughs> like I said, he saw something in those critters. He had such a way with them. I believe that the Jawas, whose enduring civilization thrives in spite of Tatooine's harsh conditions, would answer that question. Their technological prowess is quite the achievement, though their ability pales in comparison to my own. I wonder why he abandoned them. But during my daily meditation beneath the pillars, I saw a vision on the cave wall that showed me the error of my assumptions. I now know the true original people of Tatooine, the warriors whose knowledge I will use to stem the coming darkness. What is he talking about? Who are these people he's gone to? You really want to find this guy, don't you? I don't get it. Sounds perfectly sane to me. Master Ares used to take lights out to a cave near the rock pillars at night and meditate. Sounds like that's when he had his vision. Well, you're a Jedi. Maybe you could do the same thing. Visions don't exactly work that way. But I should have a look at this meditation site. You can use my old dragon flares as lights. Uh, <coughs> the cave gets pretty dark. Just be careful out there. Rumor is the sand people are getting riled up. Don't let them catch you with your lightsaber sheaths. Wouldn't uh, bet on it. Okay, let me go ahead and get Kaizen out just to give him that new thing, and I know for a fact that's better because he's had that weapon that forever. Yeah, twenty aim. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Way better. So much better. Okay, Theron. Adventure. You get any new moves? No, he didn't. Nearly a scratch. That means Kaizen probably didn't either. Okay.